You know, this morning I woke up and I feel so hurt, you know. My mother died, I lost my mother yesterday. And I know that we all have to die one day, but when it's the negligence of the hospital system in Jamaica that led to the death, the sudden death of my mother, it hurts. And I, and I think people should know what is going on in the Jamaica medical system. The health system is, is rubbish, it's garbage. So I ask you to blast this for me, put it over pink wall. I need Christopher Tufton to see this video. I need the Prime Minister to see this video. And people need to see this video. If your family member is sick, and end up at the hospital is that you can prepare plan funeral plan funeral my mother is gloria smith paris from Falmer trelawney well known beloved woman used to operate restaurant she cook give everybody she got sick in the wee hours of friday night early morning she had a stroke Two o'clock, she complained that the pressure is high and my father gave her the pressure pill. By five o'clock again, she went up herself, not responding, not talking. So they rushed to the hospital, the farmer's hospital. I reached at the farmer's hospital about 5.15. And listen to me well, I'm not making up any stories. She went to the farmer's hospital 5.15 a.m. Saturday morning. And when I got the call, my mom was ill. I reached the hospital 5.30. We don't live together. And when we went down there, I said, all right. My neighbor took her down, so I took over from my neighbor. And I said, all right, doctor, did she get anything? They said, look like she having a stroke, so she cannot get any medication. They have to do a CT scan. I say, all right, so let's get the CT scan done. Mom, there's no CT scan machine at farm water. Now listen to me. I say, oh, if you have a hospital without a CT scan machine, a big hospital, public hospital in Trilani, Falmouth. She said, we are in partnership with Radiology West Montego Bay. And so we have to wait until Radiology West is open, 8 o'clock. My mother is in pain, you know. When they check my mother pressure, 235 over 119. She said, my head. My head. She said, my neck back. She said, pain. She said, go for me pressure pill in my brown bag. And they said, we cannot give her anything because she having a stroke. They said, Lord Jesus, my mother is in pain. She said, my head. She said, my head, my head, my head. We say, all right. She wet up herself again. We say, somebody come help me change her. We change her off. We say, you have any more robe? They said, no. We say, Lord Jesus. She, the time she taking off her clothes. She torment. Pain in her head. She torment. She said, get me pressure pill. We say, mommy. So she in and out of consciousness. I say, mommy, you can't get no pill yet. We have to wait. We wait, we start car radiology was 8 o'clock, nothing, nothing. We said, but what can go? So she's suffering and she can't get nothing. We in watching my mother suffer and I say, I can't do anything. 8 o'clock, I said, Doctor, Doctor Wilkins. I said, Listen, it's 8 o'clock now. The family is ready. So we have to pay for it. I said, Money ready, let's go. Mom, you have to wait. I said, But Jesus, I said, What do you mean I have to wait? You say, The place open 8 o'clock. We're trying to call the place. I said, Call the hospital, mom. I cannot call yet because as you can see, I'm the only one working in emergency. What I said, that's not my business. My mother is suffering. I said, this is an emergency. You tell me to wait. I'm here from 5.30. She crying for her head. She waiting up herself. Oh God, my heart. You think it's easy to watch my mother suffer? Eh? We call, call radiology West. We can't get them. My sister that came from Montego Bay to farm out, had to drive back to Montego Bay to find radiology West at Fairview. We had to get a number. Give the hospital to call. Right? So we get the number. We pay the money. 
We send them the receipt and say, see the $25,000 a year it's paid. Get my mother going so she can get the CT scan so we can start treating her. She's suffering. People, Jamaica. Jamaica. When we pay the bill and get the receipt, we say, all right, doctor. Can we go now? Miss, you have to wait. I say, but what this for me do? What do you mean to? I say, yeah. me say, I'm not going to watch my mother suffer and die. What do you say we have to pay for it? We pay. Wait, it's not finished yet. If the video is shaking, my hand is trembling. I'm weak. You understand me? My brother, I come out, my brother going. My brother says, sis, they say, must wait until 12 o'clock. I say, what? And a sunny Indian my mother said, take her off her clothes. So somebody have to be at her bedside. Nothing. She can't get nothing. So she's suffering, you know, from 5.30, 5.15. The attitude. Ma'am, you have to wait. I'm the only one in. Oh, come, oh if you have one doctor, they run emergency ward at a big type 4 hospital. Anyhow, we say, can we take her to hospital? No, because if she goes to hospital... You're not going to get the rate the, the CT scan result as quickly as if she do it here. We say, all right. We say, so all right, we pay the money. So where is the ambulance? Ma'am, there's no ambulance available. We say, but what this for me do? We say, so where is the ambulance? Miss, only two ambulances working at Farmer and they are out. We say, so can we get a private ambulance? Listen to me now, you know. Ma'am. If you get a private ambulance, no hospital nurse is going to want to go on it. Mr. What? Why? Because apparently insurance don't cover them if anything happens. Mr. So, Mr. So, what you left me to do? Mr. So, what you leave the family to do? We're trying to find a way because the hospital now have no CT scan. They now have no ambulance mover. And you want to tell me, say, not, not all. We, 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 we can't, we can't, nothing. We can't provide nothing. But I remember they cry. Pass the pressure pill. Pass the pressure pill, my head, my head. She, she remember so at 5 30, no, you know. We come off the ward, then say, must wait till 12 o'clock. So you, you, I'm watching my mother suffering with pressure extremely high. Yes? All right, 12 o'clock come, Mr. Security, can you please go in and tell the doctor it's 12 o'clock? So she, she needs to go down to Radiology West Montego Bay. Security come back and tell me, so they say it's not her time. They're going to send the ambulance to hospital first with some other patient and come back. I said, Mr. You're mad. I said, I'm there from 5.30. I said, I don't know what I'm going dead. I said, security, I don't want to root to you. I said, go back. Go tell the doctor. Say, at 12 o'clock, I'm a mother. I need to go. Security come back and say, all right, all right, all right. They're going to take her. So the ambulance took her after 12 to radiology. So some family member went down there. At 5.30 before my mother came back to Farmer's Hospital because they packed up the ambulance with about four people because they shot the ambulance and they have no equipment. No equipment. That, that, so if you're sick, don't go to Farmer's Hospital. You go dead. When she come back 5.30, we say, all right. She's still crying for her, you know, from 5 o'clock in the morning. So they put her on female medical ward. We fly go over female medical ward. All right. Where the result come now so we can see what is happening so they can start treating her. No, we wait, wait, wait till 8 o'clock. Mother crying. She say, from morning, my head, they hurt me and you can't give me nothing. She said, my head. She said, send for me alcohol. She said, oh God, my head. She said, take it off. Take it off. My head hurt her till she said, take it off. She said, take it off. Take off your head. She said, take off your head. And the hurt me, take you off. Me said, nurse, not even little set of all. My mother in a pain from morning. Me said, not even little set of all. Then said, she can't get nothing. Me said, only if you pay for the CT scan, we get back the result quick. And me said, at 8 o'clock with the hospital, no result. Then said, we have to leave. We leave. And they will call us. And everybody gather at my father. Because my father is also sick. 10 o'clock. We get a call. Result come. Ma'am. The result is there. You have a prescription. She needs to get Imadipine and Panadine. And she has to get it tonight or else. And you know what or else mean. 
You say, okay, doctor. Doctor Lewis, call me. You said, okay, so give her the medication. No. Farmouth Hospital don't have any medication. They don't have any eye medicine, so you have to go find medication tonight. You say, but pharmacy lock at 10 o'clock. Dr. Louis said, well, 124 hour pharmacy, St. James Pharmacy is open. Call them. We call St. James Pharmacy, they don't have none. We start calling one a month to be There's no other 24 hour. We start to call St. Anne. Everybody in the family, we look up the family. They start to call St. Anne. No 24 hour pharmacy. We start to call Kingston because if you have to drive, go to Kingston. Because she has to get the medication tonight. Remember, you know, she's not paying from 5.30 in the morning. No medication. So everybody start to cry now. Lord have mercy. So the hospital call us and they say, you need to come in and sign some form for emergency surgery. We say, all right, we fly back. Go down to the hospital, you know, after 10. They put us on to the head surgeon, Dr. Hamilton, on the phone. And him start explaining this. And we say, doc, we cannot find the eye body pill. We say, oh, the hospital no have no pill. We say, what the hospital have? No CT scan. No ambulance not available. No pill. Me say, what the hospital have? Me say, look at my mother dead. Dr. Hamilton said, call next generation. That is a place that provides hospital supplier. They might have the pill. Thankfully, when we call, they have the pill. My family go down there in the night. $95,000, listen. $95,000 for one week supply. And the doctor said she want three weeks supply. 60 milligram every four hour. We buy the pill. They say, must get ripple mattress. We buy it. Calf pump. We buy it. We spend over nearly $150,000 that night. We get the pill. The pill reach back at farm at 1 a.m. I hand over the pill in a paper back to one. I say, give me mother the pill, please. We go home. We say, all right. At least she might get a little ease. That time, the result, the CT scan showed that my mother has bleeding. Her blood vessel burst. Listen, 